June 6th. I remember that I have plans tonight. Yeah, yeah. Don't think your bond will growing stronger. God damn it, again? Ugh. Mm. Yeah, let's let's put this off for just a moment. Maybe when I go back to Taurus, I can get a persona that's higher font, and maybe we can cut down a day on this. Oh wait, no, 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 no. Well, maybe. Yeah, we can delay it for just a little bit, I guess. Hi, do you think Stripey is okay? He said he's only here on Sundays, but I can't come that day. I wish I could play again, but I'll be okay today since you're here. I feel like we can grow closer thanks to the Hain Man persona in Yugami. I feel like I might grow closer to Michael soon. Um, yeah. No, but I do now. Well, guess what? Mom and Dad both remembered. That's cool. That's cool. Good for you. They really do care about me. Yeah, we've we've been we've been trying to tell you that. That's great news. Yeah, they were smiling and happy and everything. I got so many presents. I even got a birthday cake. Oh, cool, cool. Yeah. I I haven't really celebrated my birthday in like many years. That's not oh it's kind of true and it's kind of not true. I don't really I don't really celebrate my birthday at all. I may like hang out with friends for like an hour. That's that's about it. <laughs> used to do it all the time. How come mom and dad don't get along anymore? I know. I'll just ask them why. <laughs> I mean, uh, sure. If I know why, I can fix it and make it all better. I'm gonna make mom and dad happy again. Wish me luck, okay? We're not gonna tell her not to do it, okay? <laughs> the girl at the shrine, hanged man, rank four. I just don't know why she's hanged man. Just saying goodbye to Michael. I headed back to the dorm. All right, it's time. Let's get going. Shouldn't we talk about this some more? I still think this is a bad idea. How are you scared of ghosts, but totally fine with this? Cause stuff you can't see is way creepier. True. True. Actually, that reminds me of something. Um, I'm not really that big into like horror movies. Uh, even as like a kid, I wasn't. Especially as a kid, I wasn't. But there was one horror movie that I really liked. It was called um. Uh... Oh yeah, it's called a uh, Pontypool. It was a very interesting horror movie. It was about this guy, these people who worked at a radio station. And they were basically isolated there, but they kept hearing reports of like, um, like creepy stuff happening. And they would get like interviews of ex of people explaining what it is. And like, oddly enough, like it was scary. Um, like he only hearing about it, but not actually seeing it. And then eventually, late in the movie, we eventually did see it. I feel like the, the horror kind of like dropped off. Just because the, the unknown made it seem a lot scarier. 
Um, but yeah, Pontypool. Um, great movie. Uh, the ending is, uh, I mean, it's an ending. Um, you know, I w I'm just gonna say the ending. Um, I'll, I might even re misremember the ending. But if you don't want to be spoiled, uh, just skip ahead like 20 seconds, okay? So the ending of Pontypool is that um, the main characters are like stuck in there and then they their place got like missile bombed and I think the movie ends like that. Yeah, I don't honestly I don't remember actually. I think that's how it ended. <laughs> um but yeah, uh Pawnee Pool. You should watch it. Good movie, actually, unironically. Actually I'm more worried about the things I can't see. Like bats and knives. Why bats? Deal. So it's a little dangerous. Oh, probably baseball bats, not like animal bats. Come on, let's strike while the iron's hot. Strike. Yep, strike hard. You're actually excited about this? Yeah, I want to beat up some guys. Don't you? All right, I guess let's go then. Hey, don't mind us. We're just gonna do some um, investigating in shady places. Why can't I fast travel? Wait, seriously? And going to a place like this late at night? Not so easy to stand up guy for a stand up guy like me. Jeez. You stop complaining already. It'll be nothing. All we have to do is take the monorail to the station. What's so hard about that? Not exactly what I mean by not easy. You know, Yucatan, you might actually be scared than the punks we're bound to run into. Well, then you should be in good hands. The hell are these guys? Check out those rags. They're from Gecko High. Oh, man. This is even worse than I thought. You must have taken a wrong turn. This place ain't for you, buddy. Uh, well, I... What I'm seeing is, being here is ruining our vibe. Beat it, goatee. Goatee? Oh, you mean me. We don't need your permission to be here. Hey! You nuts! Beat the room, won't you? <laughs> she is fearless. I can read just fine. Come on, don't be intimidated by these punks. <laughs> What'd you just say? She just called us punks. Come on, let's post some pictures that'll make her daddy cry. Hope you've been practicing your sexy poses. <laughs> oh boy, that's too good. It'll be fine. These guys are scum. Oh, so now we're scum, huh? Yeah, that's what we said, yeah. Man, I feel sorry for you, goatee. This bitch is a real pain in the ass, isn't she? Oh, oh my god. Also, good job, Junpei, being the scapegoat for that punch instead of Yukari getting it. Junpei! <laughs> It'll be fine. That's enough. They didn't know what they were getting into. I'll make sure they leave. Oh, that's the guy from Sonata's hospital room. You good with that? Who do you think you are, dumbass? Then I'm walking out of this. You want some too? <laughs> that was pretty badass, actually. <laughs> Son of a bitch! Just cross the line. You think you're going home alive now? Should we find out? Uh, no, or maybe not. Man, you're not so tough once your toxic masculinity kind of runs dry, aren't you? Yeah, now I remember. 
Shinjiro Aragaki. You're from Gecko High too, aren't you? Damn it, you're gonna regret this! <laughs> oh man, Senpai! That was awesome! I remember you. You guys were in Aki's room at the hospital. You idiots. Go home. You don't belong here. Wait, what? It'll Sorry, fine. but there's something we need to know before we leave. You think he's gonna know? Did Aki tell you to come here? Um... No, he didn't actually. about that ghost story <laughs> yes that's right how'd you know the rumor's been going around those girls who wound up in the hospital were here talking shit every night hmm they brag about all the stuff they did to some girl named Yamagishi Yamagishi you mean Fuka Yamagishi from 2e you were picking on her? That's why people are saying it's Yamagishi's ghost that did it. It'll be fine. Yamagishi-san's ghost? Wait, what do you mean by that? You guys don't know? No. This Yamagishi girl might be dead. Oh. I heard she hasn't been home in over a week. Wait, what? I thought she was just out recovering. So, you mean she's still missing? So much for that ghost story. Mr. Akota is the homeroom teacher for 2E, right? Does he know about It'll this? I get it, Aki. Still trying to make up for the past. Hmm. It's you who can't let go. Um, Aki's not here. Nothing. Anyways, it's all I know. We done here? Yeah, totally. Thanks a lot. Come on. Show some appreciation. Um, thanks. You really saved us. Just don't come around here again. Thank you for helping us and for sharing what you know. That was really nice of you. Huh? Oh, uh, sorry. Just don't come here again. I wonder if he's gonna be a future party member. Hmm. Uh, Dude, I'm drenched in cold sweat. Man, what Aragaki san told us was shocking, huh? Oh. I'll let Kirijo senpai know that we found out about Yamagishi san. The fact that she's missing is no small matter. Man, we're totally gonna get yelled at for this. Uh yelled at for doing the do now without permission. I can already see it happening. That did not take up our night. That's hilarious, actually. Which is um, also a little unfortunate because um, I... <sighs> Anyways, no place to home. Gonna stop putting that place again. Uh, which is a little unfortunate because I don't have anything else to do today. So I guess... such a study? I don't know. <laughs> Does it definitely seems like a waste of day, but I don't know what else was I supposed to do.